chapter in the final eight being played out. It goes to penalties between Applewell and Leon. Back to our commentator now. Do a one on Avery get drilled. And now, can they go that ultimate step further? They might not need five penalties to do it. Depends on the performance of the goalkeeper. We're about to find out just who's volunteered. which end they're going to be taking it. Nuno Moraes is now wearing the captain's armband with the departure of Constantino Shalabidis. The former Chelsea midfielder is about to call heads or tails. They've come here in their droves, around 22,000. They do believe, and they have continued to believe. The referee's job is pretty much done now. You very rarely see cards in a penalty shootout. Who has volunteered to put themselves in F-World history? And who will be the one to try and pretty much extend Leon's season. The Championship Liga may be out of their grasp now. Seven points off a Champions League qualifying slot. A full 15 off the summit where Paris Saint-Germain lead by a point. After one three games domestically to go, this could really extend their season. But it will be the French side to go first. And Kim Chelstrom, the set-piece specialist, one of the most experienced men in the French side will get us off and underway here in Nicosia. This to give his side the impetus and the initiative. Coolly done. The silence is absolutely deafening. There are some Lille fans here. You just can't hear them. Cool as you like. a long, long walk and it is made longer by the responsibility on the shoulders of Bailton, the Brazilian striker has had a number of opportunities tonight now he has a chance to level things up what can Hugo Lully do about this? Absolutely come on! come on! Time. One more. Right into the corner. Had he guessed the right way, he might not have got there. Up steps Lissandra. Portuguese has as big a heart as many. The post, off the back of Kiotis and into the net. Had the goalkeeper not died the right way, that would have been 1 1 in the penalty mix. Fucking French fuck! You don't often see that. Is that the fortune the French side needed? <laughs> 2 1 Lille. And what a piece of fortune. Penalty shootouts aren't all about luck, but they play a huge part. Now, it is the captain, Nuno Monesh. Yes! Well, Come on! That also is pretty cool. Oh.
an eruption in Nikisi. That can be going the substitute. Oh, Kiyotis just went the right way, but it was too good. Three, two. Just five minutes, please. Just five minutes, four hours. So far, we have had Sweden, Argentina, and France score for now. Brazil and Portugal have scored for Applewell. Nectarios. Alexandru, a Cypriot, steps yes. up at last. And Come on! A huge penalty for the international. A man who came up through the ranks here, like Shadow Lambidis, who knows exactly what this would mean to everybody in the stand. Three, three. Now it gets really, really nervous. Alexandre Lacazette, whose goal gave Lee on the first leg lead, who came on and gave them impetus here. means coolness, sometimes it means hesitancy, sometimes it means he's just not sure where to put it. Come on Alex! Kiotis guessed the right way, it didn't look convincing. Advantage up well. Shut up! It's not the win. But can they take it? Ivan Tchikovsky. We'll step up and just find out. The Macedonian International. Yes! Come on! Advantage very much, Apoel. Thank you, Alec! Now, Leon need to score or they are out of the UEFA Champions League. Apoel have converted all four reverses. This to stay in the competition. Michel Bastos, what pressure. season goes from bad to worse and the party in Nicosia will last right through the night I am sure <laughs> he will be the name on many people's lips Dionysios Kiotis saves two penalties Ivan Jovanovic masterminds a remarkable campaign. A fairy tale, really. 120 minutes couldn't separate them. Penalties did what that failed to do. 4 3. The home side held their nerve. While Bastos and Lacazette could only miss. They could dream of a UEFA Champions League quarter final. And who knows what else?